Hey VC, I'm back with another video. This is a really cool video. Um, it is a lot I bought from Germany, paid 116 US dollars for it, so I'm not sure exactly how many euros it was. Uh, but I had a $50 eBay gift card that it was given to me a while back that I decided to use on this particular purchase, which brought it down to $66. Uh, there's 13 albums total, which came out to $5.30. 11 cents for each album, which I am definitely willing to pay that for these. Uh, so yeah, it's a huge lot of 13 Roy Gallagher albums, and they are all UK, German, or Holland pressings, so that is really awesome. Most of them are upgrade copies. There's a couple of them that are kind of beat up, but yeah. So the first one is his debut album, just titled Roy Gallagher. Uh, this is definitely an upgrade to my U.S. copy that is all scratched up and the cover is even destroyed. Uh, this cover, for its age, from being from 1971, is in great shape. And this particular album is a UK pressing on the Polydor label. And it's in beautiful shape. I mean, it has a few scratches here or there, but it doesn't skip at all, which the other one does. Okay, and then next we have Deuce. And this is a German reissue from, I'm not sure what year it is, but is on the Chrysalis label. And then the next one is Blueprint. This is a, what is this? Is this a German or a UK? Yeah, I think this is just a UK pressing on the Polydor label. It doesn't say, but it doesn't look like the German pressings. So that is an upgrade to my other copy that I have. And next up we got Tattoo. This cover is pretty beat up, but this is a UK pressing as well. And the record itself is beautiful. Then next up we have Live in Europe. This is a UK press. The cover is in great shape. And the album, or this is a German press, I apologize for that. Um, it's got a sticker on the label and a little stamp there, but I don't care. It's in beautiful shape. And next we have the Irish Tour 74. Gatefold double LP. And this is a UK press. Then next up we have Calling Card, which I showed in my last video that I just bought about two weeks ago. Then I got it in here. This is a... what is this? I think this is a German press. Pretty sure this is a German pressing on the Chrysalis label. And then next up we have Against the Grain. My US copy of this is beat up, so this is definitely an upgrade. And this is on the UK Chrysalis label, I believe. And it has the original inner sleeve, which is really cool. Got a cool picture of Rory on there. The next up, Top Priority. This is one of my favorite Rory Gallagher albums. My favorite song is Philby and Bad Penny off of here. And this is a Holland pressing with the original inner sleeve, which my US copy does not have. And next up is an album I didn't have. There are a couple of these that I didn't already have. And this one is one of them, Photo Finish. This has my favorite Rory Gallagher song of all time, Shadow Play, on it. And this has the original inner sleeve with it. And this is a Holland pressing on the Chrysalis label. Just a few more. Uh, Stage Struck, this is a UK press. And this has the original inner sleeve. And it, I mean, I think some of the UK pressings came with a single. This is a German pressing. Never mind. 
yeah, German pressing. But the UK pressings came with a little 7 inch single, uh, and I've seen a couple on eBay for a few bucks, so I'm probably going to buy that and just add it to this album, kind of Frankenstein it. Then we have Jinx. And this is a German, yeah, it's made in West Germany, it says. The original inner. On the German Chrysalis label again. And then the last album, I actually just bought a copy of this about a month ago, I believe, and I showed it in a video. It is Defender, and this is the UK pressing on the Demon record label. That's the original inner sleeve and the 7 inch single that came with it, so that's really awesome. Here's the label on that. So this is a copy that I'm going to be selling because I already have a copy of this. So if anybody is interested in this, let me know. I'll probably just hold on to it for a while, but yeah, if anybody needs this, um, yeah, let me know. Blackmore Rules, Greg Digg, if you need a copy of that, if you'd like it, let me know. And I'll see what I can do there. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. Let me know what you think, and I'll talk to you guys soon.